Welcome back to Blue Planet's War in Heaven for Free Space 2 here on Paladin Gaming. Uh, we'll read our personal log in a database entry, as usual. So this is, we're going into the Dreamscape. The Dreamscape is going to, the Dreamscape is going to be bonus episodes. Uh, outside the normal schedule, because they're not missions in the traditional sense. My name is Falconer. You're Laporte, I know. I'm here to brief you. No, stay there. Stay in bed. You see that wire in the back of your head? That's connected to the DNI implants in your spine and brain. We've upgraded them. Why? Good question. Lean... Lean back. I'm going to give you an injection. That? That was a sedative. Cassandra's building a link to your mind, tasting your nerves, learning to read and induce. What is Cassandra? It's a computer. It runs simulations that guide the Fedayeen. They're accurate. Insane accurate. Like prophecy. No, no, it's not intelligent. It can't think. It's a tool. A weapon. And it hosts our dreamscape. Primary objectives. Obtain information or awaken. So let's commit. Oh look, I'm not dreaming about the Indus briefing room. What a wonderful thing. She's in. We see her. Welcome to the Dreamscape report. We pool our skills through Cassandra. Glad to have you. Wow, I guess those implants weren't just for diagnostics, were they? This is a shared dream? A lot of secrets in here, Laporte. Watch yourself. Dreamscape, approach ships to speak. This is a map of the solar system, I do believe. We have Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Luna. Mars. Do you need anything, Thorn? Can we help? Just some support after the briefing. Thank you. Well, Thorn's closest. Let's go look at him. Thorn, do you people change your names to make sure you sound tough? Are there any Fedayeen named something like, uh, Lovejoy? Three of them. Too closely related. <laughs> You're an intel spook, aren't you? If you make it to operator, then I'm your analyst. I'll be planning your ops and briefing you. I've already sent a message introducing myself. For now, I can brief you on the dreamscape. This construct just stretches my credibility. I understand that some kind of network dream shared through those implants we've all got, but the bandwidth required is astronomical. It's worse than you know. The dreamscape is feeding skills, cognitive schema, and personal understanding to every connected Fedayeen. We use it to share our most basic talents, things you can't teach. So what's the trick? How do you pull this off when the Ubuntu mainframe struggle with five-year economic projections? We use Cassandra, our special computational asset. The network protocol is called Nagari. GTI discovered it during the Great War, and a Rebel Tev Admiral perfected an artificial version. Ours is based on human Nagari capability. His wasn't. Wait, human capacity? I'm sorry, but I don't buy that for one second. It's not a natural ability. It's artificially induced by an external source. There's a case on Earth right now who is exposed from birth. The things done to his brain will almost look like abuse. Oh my god. You want to share, Laporte? I'm getting some emotional bleed. Not yet. I think I might understand something, but I need to be sure. I pushed two more proxies into fail state. Curious? I'll monitor the operator's well-being. Aldawa is the only commander I know who can match steel. Okay, so once you that's the only thing he says once you once you wrap your conversation. Awake, sell soul by time. If I fly through that gate, the simulation ends. The Sudan Imperium, away out there. Humanity, Nagari Firewall, away out there. Aldawa, we must open her to him. 
I'm very curious for your read, Vidara. She can hear us, but of course you know that. This needs to be voice acted. Maziaf, FA-1337. It is Telit. Al-Dawa, that's a name with an ugly history. Will I get some answers before I put my life on the line for you? We have answers. Some of them are even true. What are your questions? <laughs> I want to know the status of Captain Lorna Sims. I can't tell you. Either because I don't know or because I know and I don't want you to know. Is that true enough for you? No. You're not entitled to my respect, Aldala. You don't even have a rank. As far as I'm concerned, you need to earn my trust if you want me to perform. Lying and obfuscating isn't going to do that. Your self-sufficiency is admirable. This is not a hierarchy. We are all our own. But for now, you must be patient. Once you've proven yourself in your first operation, I can tell you more. At least tell me who you people really are. When you recruited me, you said last remnants of mankind's collective past. What does that mean? I hear rumors about Fedeyin excess, but this seems more than a, like more than a death squad. We are a moral contingency, a way to put the castoffs of Ubuntu to good use. We inherited Galactic Terran Intelligence's darkest and most devastating secret. When you complete your first task, speak to your wingmen. They will show you their understanding of things. Thorn, Thorn buddy, Analyst Thorn. I can tell you're off task, Operator. You could be a powerful asset if you can set aside your Ubuntu past. That'll be all he says. I did Thorn. Kovacs. We need her, but I... Never willing prey. Blood, tears on scissors. Kovacs do just let go. No, I definitely will not. But I've got such plans for that software. I guess I better get used to dreaming you, Kovax. Do you see this place as a bunch of ships, too? No, I didn't make myself in the cockpit. You did. It's where you were born. Tell me about the dreamscape. I don't fall for pseudo-mystical telepathic communion crap. I want specs. I don't know how it works. I know what it's for. We share our skills, our fears, our suspicions, the things you can't speak. Gives our analysts data, gives the operators a chance to come home alive. Who was nuts enough to try this? Who was the first one to pack his skull with metal and link up? Fifty years ago, the pilot who saved the world told Elder Mando about visions of an ancient race and the purpose of the Sheevans. They figured there had to be a science behind it. It's called the Nagari Process, so here we are. The pilot who saved the world. That would be Free Space One's Alpha One. How are you, Aldawa? Says Vidara. I wonder what you hope to learn from these questions. Is she all they say? Nervous? Good. You need to fly nervous. Blood, tears on scissors. Huh. She turns to face me. Thora, I need 84 through Ka 16. So you're the dream of a woman named Falconer? Very, very lyrical. Copy injecting left temporal. That's me, soul of a poet. Listen, if it were up to me, you wouldn't be here. If it were up to me, I wouldn't be here either. I'd be painting the Carthage on my fighter's nose, but it's not up to us. And that's why I don't want you. You're locked in the past. You spend too much time thinking about inevitability, not enough about taking control. Get your knife into the wound of the now, Laporte, and then I can fly with you. You're flying with me whether you like it or not. As for living up to your creepy, creepy knife metaphors, we'll find out. Don't piss me off, Neophyte. Kovacs, dear, just let go. 
Incapa Vidara, incapacitate, decapitate. Well, that's, uh, that's reassuring. We've been here for not quite nine minutes. We'll, uh, hustle to find out everything there is to know. Get inside, open them up. Welcome to Wonderland. I was afraid you'd never make it out of the Red Room. You were afraid? Are you from First Fleet or something? Uh huh. The Fedeen aren't a demolition squad, Laporte. We get inside people's heads, enemy and friend, if you need to talk about Sims. Leave that outside, pilot. I don't carry my baggage with me and you don't get to inspect it. You can't escape cause and effect. The past determines the future. You're the most important weapon system on your ship. If you want to diagnose your faults, here I am. I've had enough of talking and thinking. When you see a problem with my actions in the field, then we talk. For now, stay out of my head. Falconer's baiting me again. <laughs> Say Thorn. She won't trust you as an analyst until you prove you can't be distracted. Well, let's fly out to the Vasudan Imperium. How do I do uh, time compression again? Want to join us in Spinal Falconer? Okay, here it is. Shadow facts. <sighs> Using the condenser guard, that's a good spin. Can't say ideation that's not going to fly. Fascist, I never get to try anything. <laughs> oh, God. V, I'm going to start some trouble with Ged. You can go ahead, I'll smooth it out. Flying out to the, fi flying out to the firewalls is actually a first time for me. Asenath, Asenath, is that you? No, Asenath don't taste doesn't taste of blood. My lord, your Imperial Infinity awakened me. I have a contact and she burns hot. Oh boy, so this isn't a fire to talk to thing, we just hear things from it. Vidara, good results from Aravel soft aggression, psyops, and lunar populations. Basis forever. Vidara is defense in depth. War is loved by other means. All right. That was too much. Okay. I can't. I basically can't employ my controls while time compressed.
Beta Wing on station and swapping designation to Alpha Wing. Ricardo Laporte. Command, once again you have surrounded me with fuckwits. Ricardo Laporte. Ricardo Laporte to Sesef Mara Terrans. Atlanta, Nix, and Draco. You dev bastards come to bomb my planet, but you don't know what you are getting yourselves into, huh? My sister here, you have messed with Noemi Laporte. Is she going to stain you Mars Brown with her poop? What? I hear a marker ship for you so you know where the smell come from. Hang on a sec. Here's uh, Alpha. The f this is not a touch screen. Hang on a sec. Hey. You, you, uh, devs, you, uh, you hold on a sec, I gotta call support. Some asshole has scratched my paint job. You should probably hide now. You should probably hide now. You know what? I agree. Alright, let's get back over there. I think it's time to awake. Hey, Noemi! Hey, your wingman, Kara Nangbang, she tell me you have a date? A date with a real person, yeah? Yes! This is amazing! Oh, I can't believe it. Oh, hey, but you know, you know, you're going to screw this up, okay? So, you take my advice, you do what I say, and we make it work, okay? So, you want to look real nice for your date, right? Yeah, well, you need all the help you can get, so of course you do. So, you take the brown paper bag I give you because I plan ahead, you take the brown paper bag I give you for your birthday last week, okay? Okay, you put it on your head, and you don't say nothing the whole time. Can you do this? This is your best chance, okay? Can you do this? God. Alright. It's, ba it's basically nonsense. Let's get out of here. Awake. Sell soul by time. I know it says 44 minutes on the clock, we spent a lot of time in time compression. Poor Pat for mission crap. Alright. So we have an option. Train for next for mission or skip training. We will do the training, but that will be the next video. So this has been the dreams this has been the first dreamscape. For the third act of War in Heaven here on Paladin Gaming. This is Paladin Gaming signing off.